Hello guys, Craig Frost here with another Juicy Tuts tutorial. Now today we're going to be working inside Photoshop once again to merge or blend, however you want to say it, two images together. Maybe you're making like a desktop background or some sort of cool graphic or something, I don't know. Well anyway, so let's get in here. Um, I'm going to bring in these two images into Photoshop. And uh, so these are the two we're going to be working with and I want to blend this image with this image. Okay, nice and smoothly. And this is a nice quick way to do it. So I'm going to select all on this image, copy, and then paste it into this one. You could do it the other way around. Uh, it doesn't really make a difference. It's just that this image is bigger than the other one. So it would make more sense to scale down rather than scale up. And I just opened the free transform tool there, held shift, and just dragged the right corner in to, um, to constrain the proportions and resize it. Now, the background layer, I'm just going to double click and click OK. That's to unlock it so we can drag it to the top um, because this layer has more of a background free space to blend with. So we'll have that on the background and then this one on the top. Okay, so I'm now going to move this one to the side. Maybe we're doing something where we have a half cut off face or something. I don't know. Anyway, so we'll leave that there. Now, you notice we've got this harsh edge. So we need to get rid of that to blend it in. So what we do is we come down the bottom right here and open up a new layer mask and now make sure your foreground is white and your background is black open up the gradient tool make sure you're on foreground to background just there I've already selected it so it's not letting me have it and then make sure you've got a linear gradient now click from somewhere roughly in the middle of the picture or just to the right of it or you just play around with it till you get the best results and then click out to the edge of the picture you want to blend and that's going to put a black and white gradient on the layer mask. Now everything white you can see, everything black you can't see. And there you go, it's blended it smoothly. We've lost a bit of the hair here so we'll just um, get a brush, make sure the hardness is um, zero. You can resize it to what you want and then just paint in white back onto the um, layer mask to uh, bring back the detail that it's started to lose and that's why we're using a layer mask instead of like using an eraser tool or something because you can just change it over and over again on here um, so there you go basically that is it I mean you can move this layer around and blend it however you want but I kind of like the half face look and you can carry on editing you can add the uh, you can add a layer mask if you I mean an adjustment layer if you want so uh, we can just like change the colors a bit well anyway, there you have it. That's how to blend two images together, or merge them, however you want to say it. Really easy inside Photoshop using a layer mask, and none of this is destructive. You can just turn the layer mask off, and you're back to how you were to begin with. Okay? So, uh, thanks for watching. Remember to um, subscribe, like, favorite, comment, all that stuff that you're supposed to do. Um, so, uh, follow us on Twitter at twitter.com forward slash juicy tuts. So uh, thanks for watching and uh, I'll see you again next time. Bye.